you have a long-term girlfriend now. Like, did she, was she a Shiki Bhutan believer before you guys got involved? And it's like, I guess that's one of the things, right? I'm going to bring my partner over and I don't want to sleep on this broke ass bed. What are we doing? Like what some of the things you hear from your friends that are living this life? Yeah. So I'll answer this in kind of two ways too, and kind of address something where uh, people ask a lot about sex on mm. the bed because that's I usually saw that in the yeah, comments. There that's was usually a lot what, of curiosity there. <laughs> yeah. Uh, that's usually what happens right on a yeah. bed. So it makes sense and why people would be like, well, what about that? So I'll address that um, kind of as like a, a leeway into the first answer of this question. So I think, you know, I'm not one to give a dating advice, but I think when you're being authentic and natural, you're going to attract the authentic person that you're meant to be with. Yeah. If you're trying to be someone that's not truly who you are, trying to impress people, um, you're going to attract the opposite person that you're meant to be with. So what I've seen, I have seen people who are like, you know, found it weird or judged me for it or whatever, but actually most of the people that I... Um, have experienced both from a relationship level, but also from a friend level are like stoked and they mm -hmm. want to hear more about it. Um, and then I have, a, I have a girlfriend and she actually says, she's like, thank God I found you not only for you know the reasons of our relationship, but also like this has improved my sleep and I would have yeah. never came across it before then, you know? Um, and then, you know, you do have to, also have to consider too, like sometimes it, it can be hard, like if you want to sleep on this and your partner doesn't, you know, there's, there's aspects of that where it comes into where you have to be, um, flexible mm -hmm. with your partner and mm -hmm. understand um, that maybe not everyone wants to sleep on this for whatever reason. Um, I do think though, if they give it a shot, they would, they would like it a lot. Um, and that kind of leads me into the next thing too, about what about the sex? Cause like I said, I get a lot of people asking me about this <laughs> and it's a funny thing. Cause I, I, you know, I'm not going to get graphic or, or anything like that. Um, but uh, the answer is like, well, I'll say this in a short answer is that there's an argument. You should buy this just for sex. Mm -hmm. Like it, it's, it's actually like you want support, you want to be able to like move and function, not like sinking into a bed, yeah, you know, right. like I, I not like I said, not to get super graphic, but um, I definitely would say that it's a better experience for both people across the board. Um, and yeah, uh, I think you even if you wanted to get super, you know, weird in that sense, you could uh, have your traditional bed and then pull out the shiki bouton when you're ready to to go for it you we, know we call it a sexy bouton if we're using <laughs> it for that it's you reminded me I, I can't believe i've only just remembered this but my brother younger brother had a water bed and i despise that thing i would lie yeah. down in it sometimes i'd like i would get seasick sleeping yeah. on this thing and now i'm thinking about some you know adventures though with a partner on the wall but it would be crazy so yeah, disastrous uh, disastrous, yeah. Yeah, disastrous. Yeah, yeah the waterbed is a is a perfect example of like the worst idea the worst idea for a bed. Yeah. Yeah, no no form or function to that at all you just kind of sink into it and it's all like gooey and mushy and i just think like life is practice yeah. and do you want to practice that do you want to practice just look slumped you know I don't, I don't think so it doesn't make much sense yeah, it's not me. natural it's not the way that humans have evolved to live and sleep so yeah you're totally right